a massive welcome back to RoboCop Rogue City. So, apparently, the glitch we had in the last video has potentially been fixed. Um, are you smoking? I think you're smoking, sir. You're definitely smoking. Smoking is dangerous, not to mention illegal. I don't give a shit about either. Ooh. Ooh, there's no excuse. Then you must suffer the consequences. Eh, no one in this country values independent thinkers anymore. You can't smoke next to some petrol. It's not a good idea. I'm sorry. It's a terrible, terrible idea of giving you a ticket. Yes, yeah, so basically what happened, in case you guys missed it, was I couldn't access a door because one of the NPC characters had merged into the floor and was blocking the doorway. Apparently, according to the patch notes, it should be fixed, but I guess we're gonna find out. Fingers crossed. I was really enjoying the game. I've not played it for now, a few days at least, and I, I really wanna try and finish it. Yeah, that was incredibly annoying. Hey you, the old man is waiting for you. Upstairs. Please be fixed. It must have been a known issue because it was like the second uh, patch note, basically. Like, yep, we we'll, we'll fix this, please. Yes. So it's true what they say. You do have some kind of defect. Because he just didn't move. I think he was supposed to do that, but he was almost like merged into the floor and like hitting the door. I don't know. But anyway, this works. It works. It got patched. Oh, it's good to see you, my boy. Leave us. I want to talk to him in private. You have to excuse me for not getting up. I'm in a rather unfortunate state. You did exceptional work at the bank. I want you to know that I am deeply grateful for your service to OCP and the city of Detroit. See, I grew up in this very apartment. Or what's left of it. It used to be a thriving neighborhood. Nothing like what you see right now. I always dreamt of turning it into the most prosperous district in the city. A new heart of Detroit. Can you imagine? Or do you think it's just an old fool's pipe dream? Ooh. Um. Yeah. Any city improvements are definitely I welcome. I agree with all city improvement plans that have the citizens' well-being in mind. Glad to know you approve. Delta City's construction is about to start. Finally, the old and frail will be replaced with the new and strong. Decay and death are terrible things. You lose everything you worked for your entire life. But I don't have to tell you what that's like. It really makes me wonder, has the time you spent in that armor been a burden to you? This is pretty deep. Um, is the only burden for the crimes. I do not dwell on that. You cannot complain about the life that was granted to you. That's very humble of you. The real reason I've summoned you here is because I'm worried. I'm aware of your instability problems, and it's not a matter that we can overlook. That's why I've requested to have people look after you. Tell me, how are you finding your evaluations with Dr. Blanche? Um, they increased my performance. Oh, so we've got like a, is that the best reply then? They're a waste of time, two side. Oh. I think they maybe increase my performance, I guess. I, I don't know. I am happy to comply with any activity that improves effectiveness. You're a good sport. I can imagine it's not a pleasant experience, but I can't express how much I'd like you to keep at it. Okay. I'm sure that becoming a liability that. is the last thing you'd want. Am I right? That is correct. Now we've reached an understanding. Tell me, is there anything I could do to put your mind at ease? Oh, I don't know. Lewis needs medical attention. 
Uh, police are concerned about the OCP's intentions. My fellow officers worry about OCP's intention regarding their work. Really? I'll have a word with Becker. Perhaps some new equipment would boost their morale. It would be appreciated. I have to say, you brought a lot of hope into this old man's heart. Now, excuse me. I'm not supposed to exert myself too much. <laughs> Doctor's orders. And you can't argue with them. I think that went pretty well. But why is he staying here, though? Take care of yourself. God. After all, the peace of Detroit depends on your well-being. All right, let's return to the streets. Yeah, that was... The, I couldn't basically get to that casting, that dialogue. And I could not proceed with the game until it was patched. Luckily, it was patched pretty quickly. So we can continue our adventures as we approach the, um, I think, the latter part of this game now. Thank you guys for your support. Leave your likes and comments and all that. Hey, Murphy, are you done yes. with the old man's tea party? Remember to get back in touch with your informer. See if he has any info that could get us back on the biker's lead. Spike is still out there. OCP wants to raise towers of glass and steel. Eh, go ahead. Just not where we live. Fair. Understandable. So I guess you guys weren't aware, this game takes place, I believe, after the second film. So we're just going to ignore the third one. <laughs> the third film wasn't, apparently, wasn't very good, apparently. I think he, he flies. Robocop gets a jetpack, which is kind of mad. Um, yeah, apparently it wasn't a very good film. So we'll just, we'll just ignore that. Yeah, it takes place after the second film, in case you guys were. So I guess Robocop is, is a known quantity at this point. Oh, hello. Jamming. Uh, is that the right way? I don't actually know. Where's Spike? No, Pickles, sorry. Not Spike. We're trying to find Spike. Hopefully Pickles can lead us in the right direction. Spike in a haystack. It's a bit weird. Is that true? Mary has to close a restaurant. Oh, no. Two words. Delta City. That's a shame. Oh, we're going to the cinema. Project Doom. Oh, it's getting so cold. Greetings. Waiting for the movie screening. Just browsing to find which movie would most enhance my nuke experience. Lovely. Maybe it's time to change your ways. Yeah. Has working with the police not made you change your ways? I need to keep up appearances. Otherwise, I wouldn't be much use as an informer, now would I? Now, tell me. What's the next job for the police's finest duo? I need information on Spike's whereabouts. That SOB. I'll never forgive him for what he did to Briggs. Luckily, there ain't much left of the street vultures after the bank heist. They're probably laying low. But now you mention it, I heard about a biker who had a crash near the riverbank just behind the mart. So, your best bet is to check out the scene of the accident, or maybe hit up a nearby mechanic to see if they know anything. All right, that might be a good idea. You really want justice for Briggs? We owe him. But we it's do. more about Daniel and Gale. Oh. And I think everyone will sleep better once those butchers are taken care of. I could not agree more. Any witnesses? Uh, there's this crazy old bum who hangs out around there. He's nosy. Maybe he could help. Okay. Are you positive that he escaped on the damaged motorcycle? <laughs> Not so much on it as with it. From what I gathered, the bike suffered more than just a dent. I'm guessing he must have dragged it to some nearby mechanic to get it back in shape. I think Ben's shop is the closest. All right. Let's Thank get to you. it. You have given me all I need. I, I, I know you're busy, but there's something that I need your help with. I will not be involved in any illegal activity. <laughs> That's very presumptuous of you. I just need help finding a VHS tape in the rental place across the street. The title slipped my mind, and I assume you've got like a database or something in your head that'll make looking That's... for it a breeze. Okay. So what do you say? Will you help me look for it? 
Okay. If it helps you stay out of trouble, let us uh, proceed. Yeah, I must solve all my problems. Let's go. I'm quite busy. Looking for a free HS. What are you looking for? So there's this movie about a guy with a gun, and there's this bad guy who wants something. I'm pretty sure the title has some biblical reference in it. You lack vital information on the subject. This is going to be a hard one, right? Yeah, back in the day, when I was a young little pup, I used to watch videos on a tape. Yep, a tape. Not a DVD, not a Blu-ray, not digitally, on a tape. I know. I'm old. <laughs> Okay. And DVDs were so good. Oh. Remember, the title has something to do with the Bible. Saints, uh, Cosmos, or whatever. Let's start by checking the thriller and drama sections. Should we ask the owner? <laughs> Forget him. He has no idea about movies. He thinks that Salamanca deserved the Golden Piston for the best picture. I heard that. And it did. Any luck? Found Garden it already. Of earthly delights. Oh man, great movie. Very elegant. Panned by the critics though. But the director is a badass. He personally showed up to one of those ceremonies to accept the award for the worst movie of the year. We do not need to bow to outside pressure. Easier said than done, my man. Diamonds are made under pressure. It's Diamonds true. are made under great pressure. Wait, you think there's a diamond within me? Do you see my shine? I'm just messing with you. That was truly inspirational. <laughs> but let's get back to it, because oh. that's not our Can we day. turn Pickles into like an actual cop? And why I wonder if that's possible. No matches, so I think we're done here, maybe on the other side. No matches. Not this one. Investigate the drama and fill us, okay. We found one! Kind Shepherd. Love that one. You know that movie Kind that never Shepherd. Happened. The director threw out the script after reading a couple of pages. Thankfully, his wife picked it out of the trash, and after reading it, she forced her husband to give it another look. Everyone deserves a second chance. Do we? I'm not so sure about that. Alex Murphy got a second chance, that is true. There's always a way back. Um, there's always there a way back. nothing that you cannot come back from. Yeah. Spoken like a true good shepherd. Anyway, I don't want to spoil the mood, but that's not the tape we're looking for. All right, we keep looking then. Nothing in thriller or drama. Okay. How about you check in the sci-fi and action Ooh. section? I'll have a look at horror. Sci-fi, one of my favorites. Still can't go over how bad the um, new Star Wars trilogy was. That was shocking. Um, yeah. <laughs> Eve's flower. Beautiful depiction of violence in that one. Really? Do you think violence can be beautiful? It's just shown with a different sensibility to what we're used to. Maybe because the guy's European. You know how they are. It's different. It's cool, is all I'm saying. Recognizing beauty in something ugly is a unique feature. <sighs> Doesn't pay the bills, though. Then again, I don't have bills to pay anyway. You know movies. There is value in that. Oh, maybe that, that could be a job down the line, potentially. You know movies. Maybe. There is value in that. Yep. There's nothing better than a good movie. But we're still missing our tape. When was the, the last really good film you guys watched? Let me know in the comments. Let me know. I'm interested. Something to do. Sorry if that triggered anyone. Action. Okay, here we go. We found one apparently. Ooh, what is it? This is the most random so episode so far. <laughs> Classic. Still waiting for a sequel, but the guy who did that one has never made a part two in his career. But he said that if he ever did, 
He'd do a sequel to that one. Uh, how do you feel about that? Sequels, remakes, comic book adaptations, etc. Um, when the book is closed, you cannot reopen it. Tend to become. Mm, I don't know. You cannot reopen a closed book. So when you're done, you're done? That's rough. Probably true. Anyway, risking to sound like a broken record, that's not the tape. What we're tape? For. Where's this tape? Hey. I oh, found it. I think I found it. I messed up the title a little. It's called Me Sire, but here it is. <sighs> Isn't that the tape we're looking for? Oh, no. Tape. Just always end up in a gunfire. What, what tape? You like movies? Do you want to shoot an action movie? I, I think I'll wait till it comes out on VHS. Lights, mm. camera, action! Jesus! Do you need assistance? Yes, I think he does. Flash him! Damn it. Is this your friend? <laughs> Damn it. Any more? Any question? Holy moly. Is that one of them? Oh, there's another one left. How did that turn into a gunfight? Over a VHS? Unbelievable. But again, first I hear a bunch of movie puns. Save the day. And then everyone starts the shooting. gone. It all happens so fast. Where's he gone? Where's Pickles? Where is Pickles? He ran out the back door. Where will I find him? I don't know. But uh, homeless or not, you still have to give an address to get a membership card. Try the computer. Maybe you'll find something there. He literally bolted completely. Cheers, Pickles. Appreciate it. Yeah, I, thought, I thought maybe a couple of guys turned up, but... Do we even know his name? Who's um, gonna pay for all this? Oh, what's his name? Oh, Josh Pickles. It's actually that's his actual surname. Sorry, I didn't realize. We have his address. Return to the streets. I really hope this game does so well because I would love to see this developer come back, do another Robocop game again with more money, more time. Uh, more back in and just yeah just i would love to see that love to see that there's so much more potential here as well there's definitely more stories to be told in this universe apparently they're working potentially on a prequel for robocop because they tried to do that whole like reboot which absolutely failed um yeah I don't know how, that, how would a prequel work i don't know in here no signs of recent use no signs of recent use this guy's having a bad day oh is he in here you're all right of course i'm okay i'm robocop talk ah uh, i overheard some torchhead saying that they were running away from the cops and went through that video store they had a wad of drug money on them and didn't want the cops taking it, so they hid it in one of the VHS oh. cases. I misheard the title, so I needed help. Wow. Wow, wow, wow. Unbelievable. You need much more help than that. <laughs> we all got problems. I, I fucked up, I know. And I get that you're on a mission to save my life or something. With all that great advice of yours, diamonds are made under great pressure. I did say that. I'm not a fucking diamond, okay? I'm a junkie. There's ah. just one thing that I need right now. Which is? All I need right now 
is a fix. Come on, Pickles. So, Don't do it. Let me keep the money. You won't hear me asking about anything else. Are you asking a police officer to leave you with money from Nuke Distribution? I know you're a police officer first, but can't you be a friend this one fucking time? Ooh. I don't know, guys. I am not doing this as a police officer. I am doing it as a friend. Hand over the case. You, you can't do this to me, man. I just did. Fuck you, Tin Man. I earned ah. that money fair and square. Pickles is not happy. I'm sorry, Pickles. I think it's for the best, though. I hope. Why is it two objectives? Oh. We're not done yet. One sec. Is this right? Yeah, this is right. It's a couple of leads. Benny boy. I need some, uh, some answers. Ah, the best cop in the hood is back. How can I be of service? I am here in regards to a fugitive. Oh, damn. What is wrong with this thing? I need to get that car down, or God knows what might happen. Can you help me out with this? It's new, and I don't know where I put the manual. Stand back. Go on, then. Let's see how it's done. You pretty pressed the red button. How to bring that car down. Can't be that hard. Are you useful, then. There we go. Beautiful. Doesn't start. Pop the hood. I'm not. Telling, I'm not a mechanic, man. So, do you know what the problem is? Let's have a look, I guess. Search for clues. Do we know how many clues we're trying to find? Oh, there's four clues. Okay. Is the battery okay? There's something here. What is that? Spark plugs are not the main culprit. There is no power. The coil has been disconnected. That would explain the car not starting. Ah, there you go. I oh, detected something. an electric current inside the cooling tank. I recommend grounding it to fix the problem, but I am sure that you knew about that already. What? I mean, I would never miss such a thing. Hmm. What is it? Is it the battery? Does the battery need replacing? Ah, oh, there we go. Got it. Battery is fine. Stable. Above 12 volts. That's one thing checked off then. I'm guessing it's an easy fix. I'm guessing so. Fix? Do you want me to fix it? What? Well, that was easy. Apparently it's Robocop's started. the ultimate We're mechanic. on the money. Well done, Robocop. You are one serious Swiss Army man. I am best at catching criminals. I should get back to it. You said earlier you were looking for someone. Spike. A biker. Have you repaired any motorcycles recently? As a matter of fact, I did. This big, chunky guy showed up. Bald head, big ears, and spiky beard. Wasn't really warm and cuddly, but he paid cash in advance. So why would I refuse? Do you Fair know play? the whereabouts of this individual? I don't, but he asked me if I do paint jobs too. Then showed me a ripped out page that had a tattoo design on it. He asked me to spray a mean looking bird onto his gas tank. Why would he do that for? Why do you think the design was intended for a tattoo? The page he handed me had other graphics, which were clearly tattoo designs. And, as far as I remember, it had the address of a tattoo parlor that's close by printed on the bottom of the page. This is a lead. What was the design you sprayed onto his motorcycle? It was some sort of bird, but I'm, I don't know what it's called. Bird a on the fuel tank. But it had a bald head. Like, sorry, I guess the fuel the tank on the bike is like yeah, to the, the main part bar. of the bike, really, isn't it? Between the legs. Well, that's a good lead, I guess. Question the tattoo artist. Alright. Where? I'm going to find you, Spiky Boy. That's, it's going to happen. I'm going to shoot you right between the eyes. It's what you deserve. Spiky. I'm coming. Not exactly. Oh, once there's a bike there. Ooh. It's not the bike we're looking for, though. It's like a 
maze. I imagine this tower is, is, is pretty busy. Just uh, assuming, I guess, but. Right, is this the place? It looks like it. Hello. Full metal armor, and you still want piercings. Hey, respect. I. Mm, mm. You could tattoo my face. That's true. That that that's doable. <laughs> I am not here for that. A tattoo, then. It'll really bring out that jawline. How about I bring out your jawline? Oh. Hey, man. No pressure. I was just trying to be helpful. Anyway, if you're not here for inking, what do you want? A biker called Spike. I heard he was your customer. I don't serve no bikers. Don't know who told you that, but it's a load of bull. Are you denying making tattoos for the street vultures? <laughs> You've got no proof, cop. Now stay off my case. I need to get back to my work. Well, I don't like this guy. Hmm. Oh, good for a few clues then. Black goggles. What next? You're gonna try to tell me that I'm smuggling nuke in a red inker? Do you? You still here? I don't want my customers to confuse my parlor for an auto shop. Oh, you're funny, aren't you? Oh, we have a few um I found clues here. Your connections to the biker gang. Naughty. Uh, I'm not telling you nothing, Cobb. Spike and what is left of the street vultures are going down. It is your choice if you want to join them. Ah, oh, fuck. I told him not to come in here when he was so hot. He brought this on himself. Where is he? Uh, he's got a place nearby somewhere, but I don't know where exactly. I am afraid this information is too vague. His motorcycle must be parked outside. It's some sort of chopper. I don't know. You can check the plate number on that photo. Wise choice for a scum artist. Oh, I can't scum concentrate artist. with all those reflections bouncing off your armor. I'm an artist. Right, finds the... Oh, who's this? Hey, Robocop. Mr. Mills would like to have a word. Oh. He's waiting in the car. I'm really busy right now. Like, right now... Come on, come on. John Mills. It is an honor to finally meet the hero of the city in person. It's a shame that our basketball team can't fill us with similar pride. Yeah, just lost to Atlanta. Some say it's because of a lack of team players. Do you think it's that important? Being a team player? Um, yeah, it increases efficiency. Cooperation among police officers helps increase efficiency. It's true. And not just among police officers. I'm glad you look at it that way. As for me, I have always valued team play. That was the way things were when my parents worked for the city. My grandfather used to tell me that this neighborhood was a great place for an evening stroll. Really? Now it's different. Kuzak really? allows the city to be taken over by criminals. He can't stop it because he's not a team player. He fails to realize that OCP has given this city its most precious treasure. You. I want to work with you and OCP to improve this city. I want to take care of your interests. It's about time someone did. But to make it a reality, we would need your support. So, what do you think about getting involved in politics? Uh. I'm a passive observer, thank you. I follow politics, but I do not take sides. So you allow others to use you, becoming a pawn. You are the symbol of the city. Everything you do, everything you say has a political impact. No matter if you talk privately or publicly, you should choose what you want to represent. Incompetence and unaccountability or partnership and determination. Only one of these paths leads Detroit to its former glory. You say you value team play. Together, let's form a team for the good of this city. We have a common goal. Together, it will be easier to achieve it. Oh, you'll have to forgive me. We're already late for another meeting. Now think about what we've discussed. 
about what we could do for this city. Together, as a team. I count on your support. <sighs> Did I support him? I mean... Okay. Uh, the last thing I said was, I don't do politics. And apparently that means I'm... What? Well, okay, sure. I think the guy might have um, presumed more than... I, don't, I, yeah, I didn't physically say I was going to support the guy. I won't stay on the fence. Anyway, we are looking for a motorbike with a... Um, what was it on the, on the fuel tank? A bird, was it? It's a bird, right? Scan. I hate the day shift. <laughs> Fair enough. Yeah, this one we saw earlier. I don't think this is the one. Nope, no match. A radio there. Let's keep looking around. Is there any bikes down here? Spike is a wanted man. Why would he just leave his bike in the open? Oh, it's a bike over here. This this might be it. I've got a good feeling. Yeah, I mean, that's a bird. I've got a good feeling about this bike. Yes. Told ya. We're going in. Let's go. Is Spike going to be here? Finally. I hope so. I have a feeling he won't be expecting us, even though he parked his bike outside. There's no way he's just in here, right? No way. Still no joy with the broadcast! Fucking OCP's good for nothing piece of shit. Be quiet, you moron! Yes, we'll get it working in no time, Mr. Wendell. Sir. Yes, we won't screw it up. He's using you. Just like he used us. He hired us, but he failed to deliver. That's why we went to get what we were owed. Ah! Oh! Talk about a sore loser. You had your chance and you blew it. Now it's the toy chance turn. Deal with it, biker bitch. I wanted to say don't be stupid, but who would I be kidding? Oh shit! Hey guys! Company. Mind if I join the party, creeps? You weren't invited! Let's crush this tin can! Let's not do that. Thank you. Oh god. What? Why are they giving me a gun with no ammo? What? Where did he go? <laughs> he just completely disappeared. Looks like spikes have better days. What's that? What's in here? Oh, stolen watch. Shame. Some fake IDs. Some nuke as well. All right, Spike. You willing to cop right now? What Come on. Will make you do. You saw it yourself. He needed us to extract brains from corpses. Most of my men didn't have the stomach Oof. for it. Why brains? Uh, he would never say. Wendell keeps his cards close to his chest. Where is he? When? Now? Uh, my bed would be in front of a screen, wherever that fucking signal is supposed to reach. Because he's always watching. Operator, requesting an ambulance. One unconscious fugitive suffering heavy blood loss. Can we detect where the signal goes? Oh, this could be a good lead. Can we find it? I think we're done. I think we have a very good lead right now. Anybody else in here? Operator, Wendell's trail leads to the outskirts west of town. Continuing pursuit. Wendell, here we come. I feel 
Like it's about to kick off, my friends. It's about to kick off. It actually seemed like Spike needed our help. I thought he was going to come in and shoot us. Shoot him, sorry. Nope, the torch heads are back. Spike's had a rough day. Let's go! Spike in a haystack. He's done. Alright, let's go and find Wendell. Once Wendell's dead, right? It's done. Like, the game's done. We completed it, I'm guessing. Wendell, Wendell, here we come. Did we get any, um, have any skill points? No. Yeah. That's annoying. Wendell, Wendell, here we come. It's going to be an al almighty fight, though, surely. He's not going to go without that. He's not going to go down without a fight. Serve and protect too. Um, I don't know what that would be. Is it available on the mission screen? It is. Does it show me where to go then? No, it doesn't. It's like six. Like we've done one of them. That was the cigarette right at the start. But they're quite hard to find, actually. Yeah, okay. Let's get going. Yeah, that's fine. Thank you. That's where he is? Wendell's in there? Alright. Wendell. Will he be expecting us? I'm hoping no. Surely he's gonna have guards. First they can't even connect a few fucking cables. There he is, just there, just shoot him. Don't even answer. Just here, just shoot him now. It's the new guy. He's waiting for some bigwig to show up. He's planning to do some psycho presentation. And who is the bigwig? That's what I want to find out. Well, Mr. Bigger? W, we still have no contact with the funhouse. I'm on the phone. <laughs> We're ready. I understand, but please tell him that this is not a meeting that can be postponed. I see. So, they ain't coming, right? Fucking suits! Keep your anger to yourself, or I'll share mine with you. Oh, not now. Who's there? Show yourself! No. Better not. As you wish, creep. You are under arrest. Come quietly. Do you really believe that's what's gonna happen? Take care of him, boys. I'll meet you on the roof. What's up, metal freak? Forget where you left your car? You better go, Miss Ortiz. It seems there will be trouble. <laughs> His style looks so good, I love it. It seems there will be trouble. He just dodged that. So he just dodged that. Eat this. He just ripped his legs off. Oh, ricochet. Yeah, eat that. Not the best shooting there, Scott, but it, it all suffice for now. Who's left? Whoa! I did not know he was there. Oh. <laughs> I'm not even sorry. Wendell! Hey, you metal go oh, that was not very nice. 
Oh, you didn't. That's gonna hurt. Do we know where we're going? Where do we go? Alex? Oh boy. Is that you? Come to us. Yeah, Dad, we're waiting, waiting for you. I don't know where you are. I'm in my subconscious, sub subconscious again. Yeah. We're back. Okay. We're back in the room. Almost getting run over. Well, we did get run over. Oh, please stop doing that. No. Wake up, Probo Cop. Dad? Alex. Are you coming? Not right now. No. I'm busy. Oh, come on! Dad? It's not a good time for this. Come on. Got a mission to do. I don't like this one bit. Do you? This is horrible. Is it going to kick off? bullets for some reason. He's not fully there, is he? Murphy. Over here, Murphy. Am I, what's going on in my head? Dad? Is, is that, that you? You, you? you look what? different. You're scaring me. I don't, I don't like how scary, scary you are now. now. Oh, great. It's, it's not, not your dad, dad kid. It's Whoa. not even a police, a police officer. officer. I don't know, I don't know what, what it is anymore. Locks. Great. What route did I just take? Yeah. Yeah. Hi. You've reached the Vandenberg store. <laughs> Please leave a message after the test. The remains of my husband, a police officer killed in the line of duty, were used to create some kind of a metal monster. I need to bury it to move forward with my life. Do you have a funeral suit that would fit that empty shell? Okay. It thinks itself as you. A world-class husband. A father. A cop. This is not time to start having these like doubts though. Like window is it, is this the roof actually? Did you, Did you hear? hear? No. It's, it's true. true. You're, you're not, not one, one of us, us anymore. anymore. You're, you're not, not human. And you're, and you're not, not a real cop. You're, you're just, just the rotting, rotting remains of Alex Murphy. Alex Murphy. Guess who dies by the way in the first film? Yeah. Yeah. Something, Something that should not exist. Oh, come on. We have to fix you. We have to erase you. And we will. Stop it. Just come to us. Come to the rooftop. We're waiting. What do you think I'm trying to do? Oh, boy. doesn't even have a bed. What's happened? What the hell? That's Wendell, right? It's the crap that is stuck to our shoe. A cuckoo egg planted by OCP. We need to clear our station of this shit. 
We must smash that thing. Fire what? at will. What the hell? Really? What is going on? You're not one of us. You feel that too, don't you? Whoa! Is that, was that actually Wendell? I'm so confused. You're back. There's coffee in the. It's your apartment. Damn. Do you like it? The mug. World class husband. Yeah, I love it. Dad. Can you fix the camera? I think, I think something's, something's broken. broken. Well, I'll have a look. Oh boy. Hey, you <laughs> fixed it! Remember I'm playing a game this afternoon? Dad wouldn't miss it, would he? Take me up at the station, I'll grab my gear. Is he getting flashbacks to when he died? Do you really have to go? You look, you look so, so sexy, sexy in that uniform. Oh. Why won't you stay a little longer? Oh, if he just stayed. If he just stayed. He would have got Ellen Murphy. I'm guessing in bed. And he would have been fine. He would have died. Oh. It's actually pretty graphic how he dies. It's one of the most famous, like, death scenes ever. Um, It's it's very graphic. Why are you here? Oh, it's kind of mad. Do you not love your family? No attachments. No leverage. This is Isn't this where he died? Yep. This no, exact spot is where he died. Everyone, Everyone wants, wants to be back, back home, home with their, their families. families. No! What are we back here again for? He got shot. Welcome, Trapper. So That's many times. Through your old home. Go back. Go on with your life like nothing happened. This is a one built by ZM Industries. It's for sale because the head of the family to which it belonged was shot in the head. Your family has forgotten. Why do you want to remember that? You attach yourself to something that is the weakest in you, to the part that's still human. Have you thought it over? Why not make me an offer? Why carry this burden? What is your sacrifice worth? Holding on to them makes you weak. Destroy them. Destroy them before they destroy you. It's definitely got a few screw looses. Confront Alex Murphy? What the? Alex Murphy? You are arrested. I'm here because you have something that belongs to me. You have my badge. Lewis gave it to me. Lewis is hurt because of you. Because you keep insisting that you're something that you're not. You think that you're a machine that's simply using my brain, but that's not true. I'm dead and I want to finally rest, but you won't let me. Your delusions keep tormenting me and my family. You need to let us go. I want my badge back. I have it. So I remember. Remember what? A lie? Lewis knows us. She would not lie. Give it to me. It's mine. But, Lewis, I want it back. This is my badge. Then I'll have to take it back myself. What? How's this gonna work? I'm gonna shoot myself. Yeah, apparently I am. <laughs> Do you even hesitate? strong enough to take him. Don't, Don't forget, forget you have, have a partner, a partner who's, who's counting on you. you. Take this gift. Don't, Don't forget, forget who you, who you are. are. Alex, Alex Murphy. Murphy. That's what she said when she gave me the badge. Can we get to get the roof up, already? Get oh. up, for God's sake. Are we still by the... That's it, Robo. Keep going. Still by the car. Where's the chopper? The cops will be here any... Wendell Antonowski. Haven't you had a... Nope. You are under arrest. You have the right to remain yes. silent. Relax. <laughs> I, I'm not your enemy. If I were, you would have already... Throw him off the roof. You have the right to an attorney. Hey! 
I wanted to help you. Release you from the burden of your past life, of your memories. But you, you don't want to lose them, right? Now I get it. Anything you say may be used against you. I can give you back those memories. All of them. We should help each other. We have the same boss! Police! God damn it, you again? People need to see this. Uh. Cuff him. He is a cop killer. Hands behind your back! Can you hand me my lighter? It's a family heirloom. I wouldn't want to lose it. You mean this trinket? It'll be safer in the prison depository. You'll pick it up yourself in... I don't know, 150 years? What's it? Is that Plenty lighter? Of time for rehabilitation. Why was he so keen about that lighter? There's not a bomb in it, is there? Top oh, story. Oh. Wendell Antonowski. Don't. The infamous don't, new don't, guy don't, in town don't. has been apprehended today. Robocop was able to capture Antonowski as reported by an eyewitness, Channel 9 Samantha Ortiz. Unfortunately, no footage of the event has emerged. Robocop's efforts have prompted a public debate regarding his status as a human being. Here's a statement from John Mills, a candidate for the mayor's office in the upcoming mayoral election. Today, Robocop has done more for this city than the current administration has done in its entire term. That's why I feel that it's time to give something back. If elected, I will be advocating to grant Robocop the status of a free, living human being. That's right. Vote Mills, vote Robocop. Staying on the topic of OCP, the CEO of Omni Consumer Products suffered a heart attack earlier today. The self-made entrepreneur has been taken to the Gibson Memorial Hospital for observation. His condition is stable. Wish you a speedy recovery. Wendell's in prison and the old man is on his way out? Could this day be any better? Geez, Steph, don't you have any respect? Here's the man of the hour. Congrats, Robo. You caught that bastard for what he did to Lewis. We are not done yet. Murphy, come talk to me after you're done with your evaluation. Yeah, I don't this isn't done yet. This, that was too easy. That was far too easy. Hmm. I think it's to do with that lighter. That's how he's gonna escape. He's gonna trigger it somehow. Not over yet. See, I told you it was too easy. It went down too easily. I just knew he'd be the one to bust that asshole. Glad we have Murphy on our team. Is that the TV personality I keep seeing on television? Yep, that's me. I'm something not many people know about me. I used to be a car mechanic before I landed this job. Is that supposed to put us at ease, Morgan? How do we do? Done the main objective. Done a few optional. Was that attack on the courthouse? Oh, I do apologize. I missed that one. Didn't find any secrets. Cool. There must have been a big like fight at the courthouse, I guess, that I completely missed. Three skill points, though. Good. Congratulations on catching Wendell. You seem to constantly be front page news. Not only that, your situation has become a topic of public debate. I imagine that could take a toll on anyone. How are you dealing with other people trying to determine your identity for you? Someone is finally fighting for my rights. I wish they would just leave me alone. I'm used to it. I am used to it. It's been a couple of, of films now. It's not your TV debut. Agree. But the status of a human would make you an autonomous being. It opens many doors. Being given human rights would let you fully take control of your life. Is that something that you'd actually want? Um, oh, I don't know. I don't need other people's approval. I need to stop crying. I do not need other people's approval to determine who I am. No. But no man is an island. 
The idea of granting you human rights is a very important issue, but no more important than the main reason for today's session. Many people might not be aware of that, but I have the whole report on the heavy glitches that you suffered before capturing Wendell. The only other time you've experienced anything similar was during the Slaughterhouse incident. That's when your partner was wounded. Now, you were fighting the person responsible for it. Do you think the severity of those glitches is caused by the intense feelings that you have towards either of them? Ooh. Maybe. I, 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 I don't know. I mean, you're the... I, I, I don't know. <laughs> My partner is important. I needed to do right by her. I know how close she is to you. Let's dig a little deeper. Your typical glitches are triggered by sensory stimulation, similar to how most people experience memories when exposed to particular sights, sounds, or smells. But this wasn't the case with the other glitches that you experienced recently? No, they triggered randomly. That's what I suspected. And now tell me, what did they seem like to you when you experienced them? Um, ooh. Corrupt visions of my past. Yeah, maybe a little bit. Yeah, I think so. Corrupted visions of my past. Bit of a thing, really. I think we're on to something. Your usual glitches were making you recall memories. No more harmful than remembering your wedding day when hearing Mendelssohn's march. We have to differentiate them from those severe malfunctions that you experienced in the slaughterhouse and at the mall. Those latter ones are the real problem, and we need to get to the bottom of it. But I think I've gathered quite a lot of valuable data, and at our next session, I'll present my conclusions. Hey, Robo, could you stop by the cells on your way to read? Someone there wants to speak to you. Oh, it's Pickles, he's back again. If it happens, I'm definitely getting sacked. I've got a degree in robotics. Pickles, 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 what are you up to now? Yeah, there's no way this is done yet. No way. Wendell's got a plan B. I don't think this was his plan to get captured. It's not one of those situations, but it's definitely got a plan B. Again, involving that lighter. There's such a big focus on the lighter. It's gonna be a bomb or something, I don't know. I'd recognize those footsteps anywhere. Hello, big O's. How's he, how you feeling? What did you do this time? <laughs> uh, why does it have to be that I did something? Maybe one of your guys just got a little over eager. Potentially. Did they? No. <laughs> but none of this matters. I'm here mainly to congratulate us. We did it. We got the guy. We, we did. We, we sure did. did, partner. Any new leads? Are you looking for trouble? This is the they lived happily ever after part of the story. No, it's not done yet. Wendell was conducting suspicious activity for someone at OCP. I want to know who. Shit. I thought you were just looking to avenge your partner. I forgot that you're a dutiful officer. All right. I'll keep my ear to the ground and see what the streets are saying. Thank you, Pickles. I appreciate that. Talk to you later, partner. Right, let's go and speak to Sergeant Reeds. What's this? Ooh. Do you guys want to join? Oh, yeah, we've got skill points. Um, also, we don't. I don't believe we have any new boards or no, nothing usable as far as I can tell. I put that there. No, I don't think that's activated. Do, 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 do. Right, skills. I've got three points. Might be worth going for this. So it marks the locations of valuable items or data on your map. That could be. And that's a bit boring, but yeah, we're doing that. Nice. So I guess anywhere on the map, it should tell us if there's anything important. Nice. Right. It's not over yet. Actually, I do. Still not used to working with one hand. 
You'll eventually forget about Murphy, being shot the first office. time. In my office. Yeah? When? When you get shot the second time. Huh. What? What? Get shot again? Catching Antonowski put a smile on a lot of people's faces, but we still have one unresolved issue. Catching his accomplice at OCP. Exactly. And when everyone realizes that OCP's been sabotaging us the whole time, mentions of a strike will come up again. We don't want that. So who do you think it is? Becker is an obvious choice. I just don't know if that's not too obvious. Do you suspect that Becker is on Windows payroll? Surely not. Really? That's, that's what it says, All apparently. All point to him. They do, don't no they? No Becker. And that leads me to another thing. Becker wanted to meet you. You're supposed to show up at some old factory. And he wanted you to come alone. Well, that's suspicious. A rather unusual request. That's why I'll get Officer Washington to listen in. By the way, how do you feel about it? Can you trust him? I... Ooh, I don't know about this. Despite shortcomings, he is trying his best. That makes me a little less anxious about signing him up to look after you. I'm skeptical of anyone that OCP tries to push on us. First Becker, then Washington. And let's not forget about Dr. Blanche. Speaking of which, Dr. Blanche, is she... Is she being helpful? Are you getting anything out of those sessions? Um... I think she, she helps. Is yeah. An enormous help. She could she be a spy. Good. That's good to hear. Sometimes that's all it takes. I will meet Becker, but there is a place I will visit first. Sure thing. In the meantime, I'll brief your overseer. Leave the Officer Washington. Again. Whoa. Yes, sir. You've got a new assignment. I'm ready and willing. Yeah. We're not going to hear about that assignment. All right, let's go. Let's leave the precincts again. Let's hit the ramp with the with the cop car, as we do every time. This feels like a trap. Why are we going to meet alone at a factory? That is weird. Why would you just come here, Becca? I don't trust you. One bit. Suspicious. Fairly suspicious. Did you watch the game yesterday? I don't know what's well, wrong with that team. Yet? I want to throw the TV out the window. No. I know the feeling. I know the feeling. I actually envy people that don't support like a football team or an American football team or something like that, because it's just Wait, so why are you stressful, me about my isn't it? And they shot me in the leg. <laughs> She's waiting for you, Murphy. All right. Thank you. Is she up and uh, up and running now? She's awake. Come on, give me the skinny. I want to know everything. Ah, oh, Murphy, we started the party a little early. I hope you don't mind. Sorry, partner. It's my fault. I just gotta hear what's happening at the precinct. In usual fashion, OCP's doing everything in its power to keep the police down. Come on, this is time to celebrate. Lewis is feeling better, Wendell's in jail. Let's party! If you don't think a strike is brewing... You know what? Let me get this grouch out of here so that you two can talk. Okay, okay, I'm going. Feel better, Lewis. Be positive! Come on! Good that she's awake, though. She's definitely on the recovery. You look well. I gotta admit, I sleep better knowing that you got that bastard. But what about you? How have you been lately? Did you get any more of those yeah, visions? A few. I still see things. You know, That's kind of ever weird. since Antonowski <laughs> showed up, they seem to be happening more often. And yeah. with greater intensity. I don't think I've ever seen you in such a state. I just know how it affects me. So I can't imagine how it affects you. The fact that he's the brother of one of those guys who shot you. True. We should not let the past haunt us. Easier said than done. His presence reminds me of the day that I, that I left you. I often think that maybe if we didn't split up that day, things would have gone down differently. 
Oh. No one could have... Yeah, honestly, if you guys go back and watch, his, his death scene is freaking dramatic. It's kind of, kind of scary as well. Because the people doing it just don't... They just don't hesitate. They, they don't reflect on what they're doing Neither at all. Of us it's terrifying, honestly. Of our actions. That doesn't make me feel any less guilty. What I don't get is if Wendell is actually the brother of one of your murderers, then why did he come out now? After all this time... And why didn't he kill you when he got a chance? That is what I intend to find out. Right. Is it true that he's working with someone from OCP? Apparently. That is what he claims. Damn, Becker. We should just lock him up already. Is it definitely him? We do, we do not we have need proof. proof. Not yet. I don't know we if get you proof heard, them. but the old man ended up in this hospital after his heart attack. I'm not even sure if he's in a state to talk, but it probably wouldn't hurt to check if he knows anything, right? Anyway, I think I need a little rest after all this excitement. Thank you for visiting me. We'll be back to working together in no time. I look forward to it. Ah, these two. Go to the VIP suites. There's a VIP area in the in in the hospital. Did you hear? We're moving the old man to a private clinic in 20 minutes. Good. I don't think come I through. can last a minute longer in this uh -huh. stench. Can I come through, please. The don't you dare block me again. Hey, where do you think you're going? To talk to the old man. You're the only one who actually showed up to pay him a visit. You know he talks about you a lot. Good. Does he? Yeah. About you being granted human rights. He's rooting for you. So maybe it's not such a bad idea. You can go in. Should he get human rights? What do you guys actually think? I'm not sure. With these visions. to improve people's lives. I was good to them. Just like you told me, mother. We did not see Delta City rise. Oh, don't you worry. I promise it will happen. Mother, why aren't you saying anything? Is he having visions as well? <laughs> Sounds like it. Michael, is that you? Your halo shines so bright. Someone at OCP was supporting Wendell's operations. I want to know who. Robocop? Oh God, I'm getting close to my final days. And I just can't stand this uncertainty. But you came back from the other side. Tell me, how was it? Was it unbearable? It was like waking up from a long nap. A new man. <laughs> I hoped that would be the case. Yeah, that's what it felt like. I believe that death isn't the end. You are walking proof of that. True. Unfortunately, I have not completed all I set out to do. All saboteurs inside OCP won't let me. Are you referring to Max Becker? That weasel seeks not only to destroy you, but also my company. Be wary of him. I know you would never let anyone jeopardize the good name of OCP. <sighs> Before you go, could you be so kind and give me some painkillers? I will try. Yep, there we go. That's better. Don't overdose, though. Always count on you. Can't I? He really does like him, doesn't he? I respect that. I sort of say he's very proud of. Face, Robo. Oh. Pump him full of OCP's cocktails and come Monday morning. He'll be back to signing deals if nothing happens. I'm not sure he's coming back from that. Honestly, he seems in a slightly bad shape. A little bit delirious as well. Never a good sign. What is this? I am this? the mayor of this city. 
Robocop, you have to intervene. What's happening? What's wrong? Maybe I can help. Is there a problem? This man is preventing me from exposing OCP's hypocrisy. The way this hospital treats its patients is the best depiction of what OCP wants to do with this city. A brave policewoman shot in the line of duty is crammed into a small room while the old man has a cozy <laughs> VIP wing point. of the hospital all to He's himself. This is what Delta City stands for. Even bigger division. But the time you had your tonsils removed, you were staying in the VIP wing too. We're not talking about me. We need to talk about the people. Robocop, please stop this madness. Make a statement. That policewoman is your partner, isn't she? So tell us, doesn't she deserve better? Uh, she does deserve. She does deserve better. I, I, I won't Those lie. Should be treated under better conditions. Hey, cameraman, you got that? Even an OCP robot sees the hypocrisy. Listen to him. Don't let OCP take away our city. Say no to Delta City. Vote for the neighborhoods. Vote for Kuzak. Okay, guys, we're leaving. The worst we should idea, find right? him a cozy, secluded, preferably padded room. Oh, let's get out of it. Again, I don't want to deal with the politics. Okay? I don't want to deal with it. I'm trying to avoid it. I only seek answers. That is all I. Why is there you guns can. there? So you can follow a command. Surprising. Surrender, or there will be trouble. Defiant as usual. Your creator screwed up the job by not installing an off switch. Well, it doesn't pay to fix their mistakes. It's cheaper just to replace you. So, Robocop. Meet the future of law enforcement. <laughs> what is that? That's an embarrassment. That is an absolute embarrassment. What is that? Power like yours, but at the oh, push come of a button. On. That is why it is not only more effective than you, but infinitely more obedient. That's just a fragment of the speech I had prepared. But hell, this product speaks for itself. Oh shoot. They do look pretty big, aren't they? Cop, what's the status? This is no appreciation party. Gunshots? What's going on? Becker has introduced me to his new robots. They're already functional? Mr. Becker bragged about them during my onboarding. I'll try to find something that can help. Just give me a sec. <laughs> Where did he go? <laughs> Don't have what their weakness is. Maybe we'll find out soon. These are honestly embarrassing. Health back. Have this. What about sniper? Your weapon. Oh, hello. Gee. Oh, that sniper's annoying me. Oh great. Robocop, I got something. What, what, what? UED will start shooting other droids. It's a bug that ended a presentation in front of the OCP board. I'm looking at the footage now. Let us see if they ever got around to fixing it. Warm up is over. Get ready for the real strike. Oh great. 
Ja, Schock. Just blow himself up. Put some more health over there. Don't mind if I do. I am the Effective one lap. Oh, repair, repair, repair. Abide my jurisdiction. Is that all of them? It's impossible for you to win. I've seen the simulations. Robocop, I've got some more on the UED project. The old man didn't like it much and wanted to shut it down. He was certain that your brain was what was making you superior to them, so Becker continued to work on the project in secret. He took a big gamble. Hey, who are you talking to? Is that Oedipus guy helping you? Well, once I'm done with you, his career is over. You are durable, I'll give you that. Here we go again. You could become a strong person in the What's that? Redundant parts have too much impact on your behavior. Damn, this gun's pretty good though. I got some more health. Oh, there's tons of them over there. Yeah, those snappers really do hit hard. Gotta be careful. Damn it! Oh. Stay alive, stay alive, stay alive. Do not die! Becker knows you are helping me. He gave me access to the OCP data himself. Under these circumstances, I feel obliged to use them any way I see fit. Until now, I didn't want to... Ah! No, you're firing! What the hell? What is he firing for? What the hell just happened? Oh my god, what waste. I don't know I don't pressing the button there. I don't know what that was about. That was annoying. What was that? Look at the last one, right? Pick up his bullets. Don't mind me. <laughs> When they just charge me. Do you think OCP will keep you running indefinitely? You cost too much and object too often. You and the police are unprofitable. That's why I made the urban enforcement droids. I'm gonna replace all of you with them. Appreciate being among the first to know. You know what? I'll turn you off anyway. You can resist, but it doesn't change anything. 
Got that ammo without dying. High five, five. Then, man, you're gonna get us killed. What are you doing? There we go. It's gotta be the last one, right? Jesus. It's gotta be it. Yes. Kiamun! For some reason the gun start, started acting different. I don't know what was happening there. It was just glitching all over the place. Unreal. So I'm guessing that was supposed to kill us. We were supposed to be dead. Look at us. We're still alive. Right. Did we pick up any... I don't know why the gun wasn't auto-firing. It should have been. I guess that's, yeah, I don't know. Anyway. Oh. Right, where is a Becca? There he is. Let's go and deal with him. Once and for all. That was an insane fight. I'm glad we did that first go though. I'm happy with that. I did, I did okay. Ish. <laughs> I'm hoping that's it, anyway. What the hell Becca, just happened? Becca, Becca, Becca. <laughs> I wasn't expecting that. Yo, I've got, got a dent on oh, me. Just stop right there. Great performance, RoboCop. Yes. And Mr. Becker, it was an excellent presentation. You promised to show me a reliable remedy for this crime wave. And you really did. Yes. I've been working on UEDs for the past five years. I'm in RoboCop. He's proved <laughs> once again that he's still top, the top player. Top, top, top. Excuse me? It just barged in here and started accusing me of conspiracy without a shred of proof. It is not stable. I have Wendell's confession. Oh, do you mean the guy that's been harvesting human organs? <laughs> Very reliable source. You keep forgetting that your organic components are the bane of my entire existence. They complicate things. I need a simple tool. A tool that I can control. And until this remote is in my hands, I have that... Oh! Well, it's uh, time for me to go. Thank you, Mr. Becker, for your presentation. I'll be watching the progress of your project. But until then, keep up the excellent work, RoboCop. And you better keep an eye on that remote. Unbelievable. That was all for a test. They're always looking for the next thing, aren't they? The next big upgrade. Well, well, well. Your upgrade failed. <laughs> 
Right, we're gonna pause it there. Um, hope you guys enjoyed the episode. Very excited for what's ever coming next. Oh, got some XP for that. Um, I didn't find all of them. Damn it! I wasn't really looking. I guess I found two. I guess there was more. A C. I got a C for that. Are you kidding me? Definitely more than a C. Two skill points. I'll take that. That should do it. What's going on over there? Becker's here, and the cops are not happy. Oh. He's come up with a shady meeting, yeah. Take the motherboard. That? that is so unethical to conduct an experiment without our supervision. Right. Back to square one. Oh, it's going to be kicking off. But I'm excited for the next episode. Thank you guys for watching. Leave your likes and comments below. And I'll see you guys soon. Bye-bye.